Uh, thank you very much for your question. Um, representing African youth at the moment where the youth are facing major challenges in the continent uh, is a huge responsibility uh, for myself first. Um, for the past years, um, since I was elected in 2014 uh, by African member states, we have been advocating for so many um, youth uh, uh, issues. Um, so when I talk about youth, I talk about youth participation economically and also uh, politically on the continent. So when we talk about youth economic po uh, participation, means uh, promoting youth entrepreneurship, for instance, on the continent how the young people of the continent access finance on the continent, how many countries in Africa are being able to provide uh, finance for the young people. And we have tangible examples of different countries that have been able to put in place national youth funds, uh, such as Namibia, um, Senegal, um, Kenya, and several other countries in my own country trying to uh, put that in place, Democratic Republic of Congo. So we believe that when we put resources in place that young people can access financial resources, we can promote entrepreneurship because it's vital to job creation. Because the major problems of African youth today is unemployment. 60% of unemployed Africans are young people. And this unemployment issue is really causing many problems on the continent, on the issue of peace and security, and so on. So we have been able, as youth leaders, uh, personally as the president of African youth, we have been able to raise awareness at African uh, leaders' level. I sit in the African Union Summit of Heads of State, the highest decision-making of the African Union to represent the youth. So what we have said is that we are raising awareness of leaders to get out of the speeches, to get out of all the things that we can say about the young people in these big meetings, but to come up with actions. If we say entrepreneurship, what do we do exactly for the young people? If we say youth political participation, how do we kill the barriers that do not give the young people the possibility to participate in decision making? How many young people we are having in parliament? How many young people we are having as ministers? How many young people we are having as heads of state on the continent? So these are the major issues that we are raising awareness. So we talk about education as well access to quality education on the continent, especially for the rural areas, for the young people, and those, the young people in conflict and post-conflict areas. Quality education access has been a major problem of these young people in the continent. So there are sectors that we can talk about in terms of youth development, education, entrepreneurship, employment, peace and security, one of the issues which we have been really leaving out. When you talk about peace and security and involvement of young people, we must make sure that in prevention, mediation, and resolution of conflicts, we involve the young people. Because when the young people go speak to other young people, the message goes across easily. And I'm talking about the youth in Somalia, I'm talking about the youth in DRC, I'm talking about the youth in South Sudan, I'm talking about the youth in Burundi and all these countries. We need to facilitate a dialogue between these youth in these conflict areas and also uh, making sure that we implement the resolution 2250 on the, of, of the UN Security Council on Youth, Peace and Security. These are the sectors that we have been able to promote. And significantly, in the issue of the African Union, in the reform uh, which is under the leadership of the President of Rwanda, uh, of the African Union, we're going to be having the African Youth Department, the full youth department in the African Union Commission. And uh, on that, we are pushing for the creation of African Youth Development Fund, already adopted at the Executive Council of the African Union, and we are sure that the upcoming uh, summit can be able to, to adopt and create that fund.